Hello, everyone, and welcome to God of War Ragnarok Part 2. So excited to get back to this. It has been a few days, and we are just wrapping up the uh, long weekend, Martin Luther King weekend, uh, back to class tomorrow. Starting this later than I intended, so very possible this won't be a particularly long episode either, but we'll see. Because um, I do need to get some sleep. Um, for the busy week ahead. I have conferences starting tomorrow, and it's just a busy time in general. So bear with me, um, but excited to get back into this. Um, last we left off, uh, Atreus said that there was something in the forest that he wanted to show us. So we're going to go and uh, check out what that is. Hopefully nothing too terrible. All right, beautiful. Beautiful. Where are we going? The old temple in the Wildwoods. Why? It'll be easier to explain once we're there. <laughs> the door didn't say anything else while you were outside. Yeah, he said he doesn't care about Jotunheim anymore, that the giants can keep their secrets. He's averted Ragnarok his own way. That sounds like a lie. You think he knows all the giants are dead? I'm more concerned that it no longer matters to him. What's he up to? Oh, it's so weird that we don't need to help him anymore. Oops. What happened oh. here? So close to home. Our radar's warring with one another now. Those are not their arrows. Something else is out here. Oof. Something that really wants him dead. More Yikes. And fresh. Did they all get in while the state was down? That or Odin cocked up the protection spell altogether. What do you see? Hmm. Just animal tracks. It wasn't you, was it? Jesus. Oh. Hey, her. come burn this bramble off. It'll be quicker. Her feet, her shoes look like my slippers. That's fun. Oof, it's not just that they're dead, but just the really vicious way that they died. Jesus Christmas. Okay. To equip the Blades of Chaos. Aim L2 plus R2 to ignite the blade. Oh yeah, this thing. I do love my blades of chaos. Almost to the bridge. So. Okay. Interesting. Oh, guess the bridge gave out. Gonna need another path to the temple. Why would you come out this way alone, lad? I had dreams calling me here. <sighs> dreams. Hey, try blades. using your blades to pull this down. Please. Oh. Sorry, Atreus. <laughs> Oopsies. Whoa. That one's still alive. No. Look closer. Ah. <sighs> Hell Raiders now? Who's doing this? I suppose it's too much to hope that an enemy of theirs would be a friend of ours. Yeah. Probably. <sighs> What happens to him? Uh... I can't target him, unfortunately. Seriously? Who'd be stringing up raiders like that? Great question. I just noticed it that the there's like frost on Leviathan. That's kind of cool. 
Wait, is there, is it on the blades as well? Nah, maybe. These are more hot though, so. Oh, dear. Whoa, what the hell, brother? What was that? Something strong and dangerous. Uh, yeah. Be on guard. Oh yeah, being all the way on guard. Me. I don't know if I trust you anymore, Atreus, if I'm being honest. Remember when I said there was someone who might help us get answers about the giants and Loki? You mean Tyr, the old god of war in these lands, who is dead. Well, for a dead man, Odin seemed pretty keen on seeing he wasn't found. <laughs> right? Saying the same thing. He knows Tyr could unite the realms against him. Plus, Tyr was the giant's greatest ally. So... Enough. Why are you so afraid of the truth, Great? I mean, I know why you're afraid, because if it fulfills prophecy, that means that you die. And that's the only thing I can think of why you're so uncomfy with this whole thing. Still putting up offerings to Odin. I don't think he cares. All right. Look out! Oh, up. Time from the dead, rather don't oh. oh, so in that case, I have to use Blades of Chaos, I think? Use to purchase skills. Press touch with attacks. That's the skills tab. Okay, so it's time to update our skills. Unlock skills with XP to gain access to new moves and abilities. Kratos and Atreus earn XP separately in combat and have their own unique skill trees. Okay. So I guess we're not using the hack silver thing to do skills no more. Not mad about it, but... Um. Oh man, why so itchy? Okay. Um. Okay, I already have that. I already have that. I already have that. A frost explosion on impact. Axeman attacks against burning enemies. Deal bonus damage. Requires upgrade two. Is this upgrade two? Knock off the rust. All right. Blades melee attacks against frosted enemies. Deal bonus damage. Probably good, right? While sprinting, press R1 to leap forward. For a rapid spinning slash that hits multiple times. Instinct. The Kratos comp a matching hit for hit. Oh, that's... Oh, okay. That's a nice thing. 
when Kratos is under pressure. I would like that. I would very much like that. Which of these other skills do I want? While evading... To perform a quick spinning double dash... Charge up the Leviathan ass, causing it to spin and slice. That seems like a good one to have. Alright. We'll go with that for now. More story, please. wasn't in the way last time I came. Uh, there we go. Yeah, dude. Like I was saying, Tyr was an ally to the Giants, so he'd be on our side if we find him. And if anyone might know who I'm supposed to be, it's him. If he's out there... We gotta find him. How can we not? Those are many ifs, Atreus. What do you know? That's You'll a fair question. Soon. That is actually a fair question. <laughs> but let's just let's just not kibosh him, Kratos. <laughs> like, let's see where this goes. We already know Atreus is a capable warrior and a capable god, god, god light. Oh. Gotten about some of these little, little rope freed. Pull the chain to tighten the slack. Let me get my axe back, back first. Okay. What do you think? Can't imagine what the lads found, but he says he has evidence. We've come this far. Let's see it. It's also interesting now that um, Kratos like actively seeks out Mimir's um, advice, as opposed to just being a passive like a, a passive party to that advice and the, uh, all of the the talking that he does so this is a Many dead here. very we refreshing change of pace moving. um oh that's a little unclear flame whiplash mash it is a chaos of fire. Follow up with R1 R2 for a fiery. It's too late. Oh, father, Ooh. use your blade. Burn that. Oh, that's dope. Oh, I love that. The blades are the coolest. I think we'll just stick with the blades for now. Get wrecked. Oh. This is some Walking Dead shit. Woof. Well, that was fun. Alright, what are we doing with these? 
Oh, we just use them as weapons. Okay. All right, I'm full up on health, it would seem. Oh. What am I supposed to do with these again? Oh, I can't. Oh, that far. Just kidding. That's a little picky. It's a little picky on the controls. Well, all right, whatever. Isn't it nice how Fimble Winter wore down all the helpful magic we acquired? Yet somehow new terrors only flourish. Well, that explains why I don't have all of my skills. Um. Ooh. Okay, well we got our Spartan Rage again. What's this shit? Kill. Winter Man. Yep, you got it. I wonder who they mean. Hmm. Kill Winterman. The runes appear to be the work of raiders, but they do not know the Winterman. Their attacks have increased as of late. Perhaps he is the source of their agitation. Also, interesting to see now that Kratos reads, um is able to read the runes or at least partially i don't recall him being able to do that at any point in the 2018 Fine. game also it is kind of sad he was picking backing on me for climbing back in the day oh they grow up so fast yet another grizzly scene <laughs> Uh, get fucked. Thank you very much. I've seen my share of bloodshed, but this is an awful lot for one morning. Oh, that is bad. Oh, uh, let me guess. Freya? Oh. Ooh, Centaur Lady, you're mean. Fuck. Fimble winter flare, the raider store note and barging in, and now stalkers playing in our woods. This is no safe haven anymore. Woof, runic attacks. Runic attacks is lighter, heavy runic attacks there, slotted into his weapons. Okay, so we're back to this component. So let's Leviathan axe. Do the axe. Winter's Bite form a mass of ice around the Leviathan Axe and run up to strike a target with incredible force. That's fun. Okay. 
All blocking. L1. Use R1 to use a light runic attack. I always forget these, though, if I'm being honest. Okay, we don't have anything heavy yet. I don't think I have any other... Yeah, I don't have any. Shield. Broken Guardian Shield. The wronged... Broken Guardian Shield. Rond of Volition. Okay. Nido. Okay. What next? You're standing here, so this must be where we're going. Father, the shield mom gave you. Thor damaged it, but now. Perhaps the dwarves could take a look at it. Perhaps later. Come on, we can get in this way. There's sentimental value. Why are we here, Atreus? Okay. You remember all those shrines we found, telling the stories of giants? How the panel on the left would be their origin, and the panel on the right would be their fate? Yes. We found many. I have seen them. Well, there's more to them than we realized. Oh, God. Well, the collapsed pillar is new, but the shrine is just on the other side. This is an annoying mechanic. Something good over on the right. Um, hey, that looks interesting. That should help. There we go. All right. Well, it's interesting that it's allowing us to incorporate both of these things now. Both of our weapons, that is. You watching? God. Come on. Atreus, wait! Yeah, I don't, I don't think, think he's waiting. waiting. <laughs> <laughs> grumpy old man. You're a grumpy old man, Kratos. What is this lot? Where are we? Somewhere only giants were meant to see. These shrines tell their stories to the world. But it turns out the real stories... The secret stories. Those they kept here. Inside. You remember the story of Skull and Hati? The wolf giants? Odin captured them because he thinks it'll help him control when Ragnarok starts. I remember. But that's not the whole story. See, Whoa. this shows the giants setting Skull and Hati free. They're free? Is this the past or the future? Depends when you're looking at it. Spoken like a giant. <laughs> See? The wolves are safe. Somewhere in Vanaheim. Not well, the first place Odin would look, I suppose. There they are, chasing the sun and moon. Old habits. Until, look, the moon gets stolen. Somehow, 
Atreus. See? Hattie's got nothing to chase. And they say celestial theft is a victimless crime. Not totally sure who this is. I feel like I'm at the planetarium. And rescues the moon. <laughs> then the moon blocks out the sun. A total eclipse. I haven't seen IMAX. one of those in a hundred winters. But then they chase an arrow, and things go back to normal. What does any of this have to do? We're coming Thank to you. that. I need the point. Phew! Excuse me. Look, here's Ragnarok. Do you see who's leading the armies against Odin? That's Tyr. If he's gonna be around at Ragnarok, that means he's gotta be alive. Right? We're here. Can this be? Odin told me he killed Tyr, and he trusted me at the time, or so I thought. What if he didn't kill him? What if he's just had him locked up somewhere all this time? We are back to ifs. Enough. Wait. We are going home. Wait. I have one more thing to show you. It's just out here. What? Like, I don't know, Kratos. We just saw a lot. Why would you be so resistant to this? I understand the whole concept of ifs, but... He just made a very convincing presentation, in my opinion. What is this? Everything I found. Not holding well, the mirror like a lantern. That's giant craftsmanship. You've been to Jordanheim again? No, I found it in one of the other shrines. Other shrines? How many have you visited? I... well... all of them? <laughs> all How many the are there? To in Midgard anyway. I don't know what it is. But it's important. Just like all this. When I was inside one of the shrines, I saw an image of Tyr imprisoned, but I couldn't tell where. There are hints inside the other shrines. You mention black smoke and the bleeding earth. But we can never figure out exactly. We. Yeah, Sindri's been helping me. <laughs> Look, I talked him into it. It, it wasn't his idea. I just needed someone to watch my back. Smoke. Bleeding earth. Could the prison be in Muswile? Unlikely. Odin's got no presence to speak of in the primordial realms. But the bleeding elf? Sounds like a mine eye. Uh, the realm of the dwarves, perhaps. Sparkle fine. That's a good bet. Their minds did belch black smoke, and Odin's had his thumb on the dwarves for a very long time. That's it then. Tears and Svartal find somewhere, imprisoned in a mine. So? What now? Oh. This way. Lad, even if we consider looking for Tear, how do you have us get into Svartal fight? You know Odin's had all travel between realms locked up tight. Sindri said he had an idea or two about that. Sindri is full of ideas. <laughs> huh. Ground looks kind of cracked there. There's a shortcut this way. Where'd you go? You up here? Hello? Oh, you did. Okay. What's under there, you think? Ooh! Ah, back to smashing through things for fun and profit. Lovely! Oh, don't be such a party pooper, Mimir. Did you hear of Odin's offer? To the lad? Not much. 
They stepped outside. But he told us about it. I wouldn't worry. What about the things he did not tell us? Yeah, I don't think Odin is to be trusted. Whoa. Hello. Um, oh. <laughs> Remember when we fought our first troll out this way? I remember you lost control. <sighs> we must tread carefully, brother. Danger is close. That's... Uh, that you was okay fighting without a shield? It is not my first time. <laughs> that was a very interesting thing that... A very interesting exchange. Because Atreus is still clearly looking for ways to connect in his father with his father outside of conflict. It, like, you know, establishing memories. And Kratos is still only able to see it in a negative light, in a way, in a essentially reflecting on his son's failure and it's just uh, and i have to ask myself why what do you gain like you know that atreus is mentioning this because he's trying to connect with you why still this refusal to connect why are you being such a bug uh. Yeah, this definitely looks like a... <laughs> Get fucked, dude. Get absolutely dumpstered. Raider Chief. Raider Chiefs adopt the strength of the mighty ox for their philgia. And visually speaking, it's quite obvious. Massive hulking forms that can weaponize nearly every part of their body should they throw their weight behind it. According to Raider tradition, chiefs are chosen through several days and nights of combat trials. Only the strongest of warriors are given the chance, and by the end of the trials, most, if not all, of the contestants are dead, including the winner. <laughs> Due to drastically dwindling numbers, I think they may have changed their methods. <laughs> That's funny. Okay. Am I fully healed? I was clearly not. Anyway. Phew. Almost home. Brother, a word. Don't hold the lad's curiosity against him. It goes with being young. In my youth, we learned obedience. And is that what you wish for him? Brother, he's going to walk his own path. If you don't want him walking away from you, then smarten up and walk with him a while. Hmm. Hmm. Generational trauma. You were a Spartan, Kratos. Atreus is not. If we could find a way to open Rome travel to Spartalfon, I bet there'd be all sorts of useful equipment for us to- Enough. You will go. Really? But if we do not find Tyr, you will abandon your search for good. All right. You won't be sorry. All right, I guess I'll take a compromise.
Kratos! Over here! Sindri! As I live and breathe, is that Atreus? It's been so long! How you grown? Uh, oh, yeah. Well, if you'll follow me... Brock mentioned you needed somewhere safe to spend the night, and I believe your favorite dwarves can help you out with that. We're still your favorite dwarves, right? You're still the only dwarves we know. I'll take it. <laughs> I love After these you, guys. my friends. Knock, knock. Where are we going? The cleanest cabin in all the nine realms. And I'd prefer it to stay that way. Not looking at anyone in particular. Kratos. <laughs> After that Thor incident, we thought we should make up some rooms. Till you can figure out your next moves. Nearly there. As you can see, we've settled here in the realm between realms. It's nothing much, but it's safe from Fimble Winter. Safe from Odin's eyes. And you really can't beat the view if you're into shimmering gray voids. That's amazing, Sin. It's fucking we have gorgeous. We have a plan to talk to you about, actually. Intriguing. Oh my god. This is so gorgeous. Oh, I'd love to vacation here. Come in. Come in! Now, if you would just wipe your feet very thoroughly, I'll wait. Ah! You're not gonna wipe your feet, are you? Okay then, your bedrooms are there, the kitchen is just over there. Any... Anybody need a snack? Kratos? Snack? I do not need a snack. What we need <laughs> is your help getting to Sparto Farm so we can try and rescue Tyr. To Tyr? Alive? I mean, that's... What? It's okay. I told him everything. Everything? You waited my son and disobeyed me. No, I I kept an eye on him. <laughs> Nothing risky. Everything very safe. Somebody else speak. What's important right now is that we try and open up travel between realms again. You said you know a way? Yes, I do. I just... It's just... There's... It's just a lot of mud. Then why haven't you opened the way already, man? Well, to be frank, there was... Something we needed your help with. Oh! The Holdra brothers finally require the services of the smartest man alive. That's it precisely. Hey! Not so bad. How'd that get in here? What the hell is he anyway? That is my son. Well, what in all yarns me the happen to him? He's too damn tall now. <laughs> it looks like that. <laughs> I blame you. I love you both. Well, come on, then. Let's get him something that fits at least. <laughs> He's just getting older, you dark flat. Didn't you ever have an awkward phase in your youth? Hey, I suppose what's done is done. Did you ever have an awkward phase? You'll be putting your foot down from now on if you know what's good. Oh, he's trying. Believe me. All right, let's gear you fuckers up before you go off galloping. <laughs> Begin with this. Mmm. Busted up good. <laughs> Wouldn't you rather I just whip you up a new one? It is important to me. Well, I'll see what I can do. In the meanwhile, how about I fix you up with something to get you by? All right. Upgrade time. I, lo I love Brock and Sindri so much. Um, okay. Um, craft and upgrade armor. <coughs> to forge a new shield. Navigate to the shields menu. I only got materials to make one of these in the here and now. You bring me more resources, we'll see what we can do. Oh, that's a big shield. Well, this one... 
high risk, high reward parries. And striking back. I think Stonewall is a little bit more my style. Dauntless shield. Okay. R2. Brock will craft some custom armor to fit Atreus. Navigate to companion armor. Okay. If the kid's gonna insist on getting taller, Ooh. best make a habit of swinging in for new duds. Oh, that makes him look so cool. Let's go, brother's brand vestment. Nice, makes him look very adult. Well done. What are... We have the Pauldron of Might. I've just never liked the full armor coverings for, for Kratos. I need more forged iron to upgrade it. Wrist armor. Certainly have enough hus er, uh, uh, hack silver. Fortified husk arm guards. Or vidars. Increased strength sounds good. We'll equip those. Um, waist armor. Fortified husk girdle. Or Vidar's belt of might. Vidar's belt of might looks pretty cool. I mean, they all look pretty cool, to be fair. But this one gives me a little blend of strength and defense. So we'll go with that. Um. Hmm. Looks like Thimble Winner's been hard on our girl. <laughs> Give her here. She's overdue for some Brock. All right, increase the strength. Upgrade to the axe, make it look all nice and purdy. Stats and damage increased. I don't think he has anything for the Blades of Chaos, unfortunately. Do we have anything we can sell? Not at present. Okay. Found some items you left behind. Tossed them in the chest. What would you do <laughs> without me? Shop I'm gonna go look around. Check out my room. Eight. You may have left behind. Tell when you're ready. All right. <laughs> I want to see the. Codex entry on. Oops. Lore. Friends. Brock. The dwarven blacksmith Brock. Brock was the first ally we encountered when we set out for the mountain's peak. He and his brother Sindri made the Leviathan axe for Fey, and this has been our common bond. Brock's, Brock is blunt with a foul tongue, but there is a wisdom in his bluster. I find him acceptable company. <laughs> this place is great, Sindri. Ooh. You built it all yourself? You know it. What'll it be? It might mean I can get... Uh, there was an upgrade I was looking at. Need something special? 
Oh, I don't have enough hack silver now. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. No refunds. <laughs> All right. Yeah, this place is cool. Hey, come see. I guess this is where they store the food. Nice to have options if I wake up hungry. Cool. Ooh. I guess that's my bed. That's a choice, I guess. All right. Anything else to look at? I don't think so, right? Oh, that is See? I knew you wanted a snack. <laughs> I knew you wanted the snack. That's awesome. Anything here? No? Okay. Alright, let's go talk to Sindri. Finding everything alright, I hope? How do we unlock the realms? We'll just need something from back at the workshop. Follow me, and be sure to bring the head. <laughs> so, where exactly is Tyr being held? He is imprisoned in a mine somewhere. That's all we know so far. Hmm. The realm is full of mines, you realize. You'll need help narrowing it down. Ooh, you should talk to Durlin. Who's Durlin? He's a cousin of ours, sort of. Works for the city on safety issues. Should have access to all kinds of information on mines. And I know he's no friend of Odin. That's why your mother sought his help when she was trying to whip up a rebellion. Ready? Oh. A rebellion? Did you know about that? I did not. A rebel leader who knew mom. Sounds like exactly what we need. I think you missed the ta-da. <laughs> well, never mind. I'll have this oiled up in no time. Meet you at the gateway outside. Rebel leader, Derlin? <laughs> if that ain't giving a hound a haircut. Huh? And you, you just remember things however they pop into your being, don't you? I suppose you think Derlin's just counting the days until a couple of strays show up looking for trouble. <laughs> what do you mean, bro? Will you help us or not? Oh, never mind. It ain't old Brock's place to cast asparagations on my relations. Asparagations? This mud sponger notwithstanding. Ignoring you. Fine. Go darken Derlin's door. See for yourself how it goes. Just be warned, he's not the friendly sort of dwarf folk you're used to. He's cranky as all get out. And he talk funny, too. Sounds like a true study in contrast. <laughs> Uh, I love this game. The writers deserve a raise. You hear that? Are those some kind of dragons? They're so far, I can't tell how big they are. Ooh. I imagine they're large. Let's go. We'll just need the Bifrost and the head. Brock, do the touching. Oh, this would be the part requiring my assistance then. You said it. This device here has been crafted to your measurements. It'll help you get a better look at the problem with those Bifrost eyes of yours. So I... Do I control this thing somehow, then? Oh, no, 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 no. This is just to hold you in place while we shine this light in your eyes. Oh, oh, Cindy, you bastard! <laughs> Open. Open now. I was really hoping not to use the eyelid clamps. Do it. <laughs> oh! That's it. That's it. 
Good. Now, release! Still no us, Blazin'? Oh, that's our cue. Come on, hurry. I'm coming, I'm coming. Crossful of eggs, man. What was that for? You'll see soon enough. Crossful guards eggs. There. That should do it. What the frick? See? No permanent damage. I'll show you permanent damage, you wee fuck! Vitos! <laughs> Throw me at him! Horns! Fuss! <laughs> Can't you take a joke, you old goat? <laughs> <laughs> Poor Mimir. The Bifrost is broken. Now that we've reconfigured these gateways to use Yggdrasil seeds, you won't need a travel table or a Bifrost lamp anymore. I also used it for light. Okay, good note. I'll figure something out, but first, come on, let me show you how it works. I also used it for light. <laughs> Aim your key at the rune for Svartalfheim on the right, then concentrate. Unlock access and shine the light of Yggdrasil on Svartalfheim. Okay. The path. Press X while hovering over the wetlands mystic gateway. Okay. This should take you to the wetlands outside Nidavellir city. Just make your way to the town square and ask for Durlin at the tavern. You sure they'll know I'm at the tavern? Durlin's always been an inveterate inebriate. I suppose he might have completely changed, but in my experience, Eh. Did you want to come with us? Oh, I might drop in, but the wetlands are moist. And the grim are everywhere. Hostile, slimy, foul-smelling creatures. But good luck! Thanks. <laughs> Wait, what? I said good luck! Oh. Oh. The quest for tear. Do you feel that? What's that like? Anything. E everything. It's warm. Yeah, this is definitely better than, uh... We can probably use this boat. Winter shit. If I can just get it free. Uh, Careful, uh, lad. Uh, Why are these things so fast? Oh, what a welcome. Lisa! Find your watcher! Behind your brother! Ow. I see we're already off to a lively start. He's doing the same thing. You dropped your guard. I got the boat free, though. We can head through these channels when you're ready. Well, you know, I'll take a little quick look around. A quick look see doodle. Just a quick one. What's the chain in the water for? That'd be a dwarven supply ferry. Said ferry appears to be missing. Huh. Hmm. This feels quite tropical. So this is a completely separate realm where the dwarves live. It is not Midgard, which I suppose makes sense. I still can't believe Mom led a whole rebellion here against Odin and never talked about it. I know. I would love well, context. Might have caught that notion. 
What your mother did before we met was her business. Did you ever ask? I think that's Eyes on the water. There are resources. Gorgeous, though, wow. If you never asked Mom about what she used to do, what did you talk about when you met? Like, did you just say, Woman, go out the house. <laughs> I will go to catch fish in the river. <laughs> and then leave for five days? <laughs> no. Your mother was far better at fishing than I. <laughs> they go fishing for five days? <laughs> Uh, did you see that over there? Oh, the music is lovely. Something's about to go wrong, though, I know it. That wheel is blocking the channel. I imagine if you can turn it, we should be able to get through. Thank you, Captain Obvious. So, these are wetlands, huh? Pretty accurate. It is a bog. The smell is making my eyes burn. You know what is a fair bit more potent than when I last visited, now that you mention it. Looks like the path continues on the other side of that geyser. <laughs> if only we were in Midgard, that water would be frozen in a second. Brother, do you think freezing it would work? I was just thinking the same thing. <laughs> Fun. Ooh, one of these bad boys. There's one, two, where's the third one? One, two, hello, donde esta numero tres? There's a third one. Maybe up there? Oh. Looks to be an artifact from the Dwarven Resistance. Fade Mars Brasser, father of a few dwarves you may be well familiar with. Rock may be interested in getting these back. Better in his hands than out in the open. Good to know. Ah, there it is. There's R. Increase, we love it. Think that's dirty enough to climb? Aye, good old dwarven craftsmanship. <laughs> huh? Tyr was a friend to the giants. I wonder if he and Mom ever met. 
if he was a part of the rebellion here. I certainly possible. Yeah, at this point, that's sure my suspicion. Although I don't recall if he ever declared allegiance outright. Come on. There's got to be a faster way to get down there. Atreus, come on, really? It's like you've never played a video game in your life. Uh-oh. Left I'm not gonna waste my certain rage on you fuckers. Thank you. Ow. Shield ability. Hold L1 to absorb standard and guard break yellow ring attacks. Yeah, I don't parry much though. Bye bye. want to fuck around and find out very good all right I want that chest Iron, let's go. Boop. All right. Boop. I guess I could have gone this way. All right. Up. Okay. There's got to be some way to turn the wheel up here. End up snout deep in cheek. The ground. Was that an earthquake? <laughs> hmm. An occasional but not unheard of happenstance in Svartalfheim. With all the mining here, the land's bound to be a wee bit bothered. Think you can reach the wheel from here? Can you... Um... Oh. Of course. <laughs> I got this. <laughs> Oh, wow. Nice job getting it to lower exactly where we need it. <laughs> Are you being a smartass? This is why I didn't have kids. All right. <clears throat> I was thinking... Because it's so warm, maybe it's not that the cold hasn't made it here yet, but maybe it's just different in Svartalfheim? Aye, lad. Fimble Winter doesn't strike all realms quite the same way. Weird that Fimble Winter doesn't always make it winter. In Midgard it does, but as you can see, the effects here appear far more gaseous in nature. Okay, so it's not that it's not geysers. affected. Observe the aforementioned aroma. These effects were present before in some form, but now there's new extremity to Got them. it. Okay. That makes sense. Onwards. Think we can fit under that bridge?
Not sure how you propelled that, but okay. something. Okay. Money's money. We take those. Um. Nice. We take these two. So it seems this is mostly just loot. That's okay. We like loot. We love loot. I love loot. Gimme, gimme. Anything down here? Oof. Seems it didn't go well for you. Fine, I'll take it. Whoop. Loot, 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 loot. I don't... We have the same issue where we won't... We can't open chests. We just have to smash them open with our hands. Father, up there. Where? Oh. Good catch, bro. <laughs> Definitely would have missed that. Okay. We're certainly making a lot of money. Oh, rawhide. Find right. anything good up there? Yes, I did. Oh, I get it. So the highlighted places are where I can find shit. Got it. Just annoying. Good lord. It is worrisome seeing all the dead dwarves, though. At least I've seen a few now. Did they cap those geysers? <laughs> they seem like it. Hmm. I think we need to get that wheel moving, but the water doesn't reach. Hmm. We're gonna have to figure out. Oh. 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 
Okay, we froze one of those geysers. Is there another one somewhere? The puzzles get a little tricksy for me. I'm not particularly adept at puzzles of this nature. Okay. I think I understand what needs to happen. We need to freeze this one. Hmm, I don't think there's enough. I don't think I have enough. I well, maybe I can do it from here. Okay, higher up maybe. No. Maybe a little lower? No. Okay. Hum. Hey, did that geyser up there just get stronger? Yes, I understand the concept of what it is when you do. Pressure must have changed for the ones around it. Yes, I I understand that 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 aspect of it, Atreus. I'm just trying to figure out how to how exactly. Maybe there's a vent. We can get a better look. Okay, there we go. This is where I can. Go. Yeah. The wheels moving and the gates coming down. Max, more of an ingenuity for you. Back to the boat. I need to go the other way. We don't want to change the pressure yet. Right, if the dwarves of this realm are anything like Rock and Sindri, it's hard to imagine them siding with Odin. Well, all too often people are blinded to all but their immediate self-interest. Odin offer them safety, and defying him can be quite dangerous. Maybe they just need a couple of gods to come along and take the fight to him. Atreus, that is not why we are here. I was only joking. War is not a joke, especially where gods are concerned. That is... Hmm, that's fair. Um, but also... I feel like I'm being too hard on Kratos with a lot of his engagements with Atreus. But, like, this is just another example to show how the the starkly diff different backgrounds that both Kratos and Atreus have. That, like, there's no way for, for Kratos to even, like, understand the context with which, like, Atreus might make a joke like that. Like, for Kratos has come a long way. Um, and you can't really be too mad at Atreus since he just doesn't know enough about his dad's history. Yikes. This place is wrecked. 
And yes, I am staying alert. There are probably tons of those Grim around. Ah, oh, another chest. Uh, okay, let's see. Left side is coming. Yep, there it is. What to do because I can't see. Nista. Mm. <laughs> okay. Um. Gross. Ow. Oh, okay. Next order of business. This thing. The other two um, runes. Okay, so wait. So the first one was that V thing. Now we need a B and an N. I was correct. It was. Okay. So now we need an N.
Um. <gasps> yeah, hang on, Atreus. Ooh, what's this? Ooh. Chest. Gold. Good, good. Deadly obsidian handles. A blades attachment. Handles that feed the chaos that resides in the blades themselves. Let's go. Blades attachments. Ooh. Boosts the strength. Felling a foe feeds the Spartan Rage. I will take it. Aha! And we found the last one. We need the end. So. Chest should be open. Maximum rage increase. Nice. Blood mead. Jeez. Okay. Love that. Love, 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 love that. More Spartan rage is always good news. Okay, so we should get back up there, which we can do from over here. really at least want to get to this town they spoke of. Like, it's hard for me to process that there is a town. All right, do your thing, Atreus. Good thing you learned the runes, brother. I think that's everything here. Want to get going? Was this not the next, the next path? Did I just <laughs> screw up? Yeah, I guess it was just a... Oh, huh, all right. I'm just out here side questing without even realizing. I thought that was the next place we were supposed to go. I missed the... I missed the, the like, compass thing that Freya gave us in the last game. came from. You turn. It seems, Treas, you intend to recruit Tyr as an ally for war. I just... I'm trying to keep our options open. <laughs> Let's just keep moving. I'm glad we're out here, exploring a new realm. Maybe we could just try to enjoy the warmth. All right, another puzzle to solve, it seems. Looks like we gotta find a way to open that gate if we wanna get to neither of them. Ah, thank you for the... Again, for the obvious. Beast. It's too fast. Then how shall we catch it? Flank it. Attack from behind. Good.
gotta get behind it. But how? Hmm. Uh, forged iron. Oh, I dropped a lot of stuff, actually. Father, up there. Say less. Whoa. Right there. There's got to be another chain to lower the rest of the gate. Ah, there it is. Um, question is how to get Look, there. There's a chain we can pull up there. But how do we get up there? I hear a trace about to ask. Freeze the geyser, the pressure will turn the wheel. Yes. <gasps> nice one. The block's coming down. There we go. Progress is progress. Anything from that block? Probably what we should do is freeze this. Yep. Let's go. That's one of Cavassier's poems. Cavassier. Very highbrow. You should collect any others you find. Well, I like to collect things, so that'll probably happen. Okay, skadoosh. Exactly, are you hoping to learn from Tia? Well, like I said, I was hoping he could tell me something about Loki. I'd also like to hear some of his stories. Traveling to other lands, giant stuff, and maybe about what it was like to fight back in the day. Just for the history, obviously. The history. Let's hope Tia's in a talkative mood after being in prison for so long. Not all of Odin's captives can be as charmingly voluble as myself. <laughs> we have no proof Tyr is truly here. Right. <laughs> yeah, the, the, the naivety of another one? Atreus. It's unlikely, but geological disturbances tend to be unpredictable. If the geysers and smell here are worse because of Fumble Winter, maybe the earthquakes are too? Aye, mm. you might be onto something, lad. Atreus, look ahead. 
Whoa. Ah, now this looks like a city. Welcome to Nidavellir, brothers. Nidavellir. Hey, dwarves! Oh. They're, uh, running away. Nope, they're definitely not happy to see us. An alarm. I'd only send an alarm like that if I still had my body. I was fearing the notion of being detached from it. Why hold that for us, though? They are scared. Wow. Most definitely an alarm, I'm afraid. Why is everybody hiding? Stay alert. Yeah, this can't be good. Oh, the music's getting a little ominous. Making me a little scared. Hey, could we talk to you for a minute? Please. There'll be no help, to be sure. Best we find the tavern Sindri mentioned on our own, and hope they let us in. Oh, what's that? The buildings here really are incredible. The detail in the woodwork is quite extraordinary. <laughs> I guess I don't have the skills yet to undo whatever magic that is. These look like Hobbit homes, actually, a little bit. It's beautiful, though. Wow. This is really pretty. Because I feel like you're getting that that Norse style of the houses. They look a lot like longhouses. But with the industrial, like, hardiness of the dwarves. With all of, like, the steel and machinery and everything that they use to power this, this city. This is really cool. Is that a statue of Odin? They must really love him here. Or oh, for you. Yeah, or fear him. Sentry! Hello! I'd return your surprise, but I did know you'd be here. I've <laughs> got something for you. How Sindri does this is beyond me. How the dwarves in general do this is beyond me. What is a dwarf? You know, I'm glad I came back here at least once before Ragnarok. Oh, if these cobblestones could talk. Then they'd have mouths. <laughs> Filthy, disgusting mouths. <laughs> Do you mind if I fiddle with your bow? <laughs> I love Sindri so much. Oh, you are long overdue for a replacement. <sighs> Taking advantage of certain material. Ow. Structural sensitivity to sonic vibrations has been something uh, I've been meaning to try for quite some time now. Thanks for uh, finally trying it. What's it going to be this time? Patience. I find it's best to see these things oh, in action. Ah. <laughs> That's how we're gonna get that chest. Oh, take aim at that gate there. But before you loose, say Skialfa. 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 Ah! Well, I certainly didn't expect you to disturb half the creepy crawlies in need of a lair. How was I supposed to know they were there? Behind you, father! Sindri is surprisingly calm for all this. Alright. Okay, so, Derlin. Sindri, any idea where the tavern is? Do I look like I've ever been to a filthy tavern? <laughs> The sewer you just punched a hole through seems promising, though. For you. It should lead to the other side of the city. 
It's not like you're able to open other doors around here. Okay. At your service. Resurrection stones. Kratos can now purchase resurrection stones. So this stones. lockdown really is because of us? Oh my, yes. Odin's grip on this realm is so firm, any outsider is considered a threat. Sounds like an Odinism if I ever had one. Oh. Uh, these one-use stones can revive Kratos from death as long as he is not alone. Okay. talk about Kratos <laughs> um, oh yes we have some items to sell artifacts things left behind that belonged to one of the rebels didn't it We definitely don't want to sell the resurrection stuff. Till we meet again. Oops, I don't think that was what I wanted. I wanted. What can I make for you? I think I wanted to. Yeah, I want to upgrade this. I like this one better. Hey, what happened to all the armor we made you already? I used it. Well, maybe try to make this one last longer. I will not. <laughs> all right, cool. I like it. It's just be it's it's much more like feels more Kratos. Be safe. Okay, but before we go that way, let's use that newfangled power of Atreus and get this chest. Because I'm salivating. Let's go. Another of Cavassia's poems. Nice. More loot to sell to the brothers. <laughs> Slag deposits and hack silver. Ugh, it's almost 1 a.m. I need to go to bed soon. Mm. Sit through the sewer that we just opened up. Well, first things first. Whatever you need. Nothing appeals to you? I sold stuff to you. Just chill. All right. What's up here? Ooh, another chest. Let's go. Money, money, money. I think it just takes me down to where I was. Ugh, this place is ooh. One of these. One less feathery spy. Ravens killed. One forty-eight. Nice. So much stuff here. So much stuff to find. All right, through here, he says. Best of luck. Any outsider is considered a threat. Is that to protect the dwarves? It sounds like it. But knowing Odin, there's sure to be an ulterior motive. Well, everyone's hiding on this side too. Odin's occupation of this realm has its hooks in deep. 
But there aren't any guards patrolling. We're clearly not a threat. Why hide? Resist and you made an example of. To keep the rest in line. Self-preservation can outweigh bravery for even the strongest of folk. Fear keeps them safe and alive. Tavern's gotta be around here somewhere. Maybe we can try knocking on some doors for directions. Fear keeps people alive. Could you Why? Maybe... No! Thank you. Why does that sound so... Ah, so foreshadowed. Or just very much like Kratos is speaking <laughs> speaking for himself. Ooh. It's like Halloween over here. Oh. This looks promising, right? Well, it's like a house. If he's here, maybe you should let me do the talking. You. Well, we don't want to intimidate him. You're tall as a tree and you have a severed head on your head. <coughs> None taken. Good point, though. Very well. I think that's him. Oh, we found him very quickly. If Hello? That's him. Watch yourselves. Apparently, there are intruders about. Oh, that's us, I think. Eh, well, if you're planning on killing me, at least let me finish this song. That alarm was in just the perfect key. We're just looking for a friend of ours named Durlin. <laughs> well, we both know that's not true. Durlin's got no friends left. But if that's all you need, head out the back way there, and you'll see the safety office just across the river. Just don't go making trouble for the rest of us. And while you travel through this realm, maybe you could clean up the head's mess? What mess? Later, brother. Um, the head's mess. I wish to hear of this mess. The rig's in the bay. Why don't you ask the condescending skull? Head, I've got skin. <laughs> but he's right. I made a mistake. I'd have us shut them down. In service of Asgard. Oh, so he did some shit. Shut down the mining rigs. Alright, so that's a side quest. We'll get to that later. Sorry, one more thing. Although, these are gifts I'm giving to you, so I shouldn't be sorry and you should be thankful. Anyways, here. Please be careful. It's beautiful. Thanks, Sindri. It is beautiful, isn't it? It's also very useful. You'll be able to find anything your heart desires with it. Really? As long as your heart desires the locations your father and you decide and plot to travel together, then yes. <laughs> It is a compass. Ah, but a beautiful Ooh. compass. Now scamper off. Are we going to be able to track our missions now? Oh! Thank you, God. I missed this. The Dwarven compass and map can guide Kratos to objectives. Press the left side of the touchpad button to jump to the map. Nice. Oh, this is lovely. Perfect. And where are we? Oh, okay. So we are close-ish. Sweet. The side panel displays ongoing quest object. Ongoing quest progress. Press down or up to toggle between the realm and region view. There's a realm. Go to journal. Quest for Tear. Boat to Durlin's office. Okay.
All right, amazing. Come, a boat cannot be far. Huh? Earlier, Sindri made it sound like Darlin was some sort of rebellion leader. Doesn't sound like anyone's following him. Was being the key word here, little brother. I saw a dock back there. Maybe there's a boat we can use to get to Darlin's. We will do that, but I want to see what this is. Because there's stuff. Are we just like walking into people's homes and doing this? Also, Kratos, your calves strength is nothing short of miraculous. that the game is like a little bit glitchy so we're just gonna save just in case a mystic gateway was added to the map Cool. I don't need that at the moment. There's a building just past these rocks behind me. Maybe we should head that way. Man, why is uh, it those so bloody mining rigs. What about them? The Skald is right to blame me for them. They were my idea. If you've got the time in the bay just beyond this tunnel. I'd particularly appreciate us checking out the mining rigs in the lake to the right. You can see the smokestacks from here. Yeah, we'll get to those. But if you don't want to explore now, it looks like Derlin's place is through that open gate to the left. Yeah, I don't feel like exploring right now. I would like to... So, which way do we go? Left. Ah, oh, yeah, why is so it we're so going to Durland's? glitchy all Makes of a sense. sudden? We can always explore those mining rigs later. We will! This is the safety office? Well, the sign is going on. That certainly gives that impression. Shoot. All right, give me some story. Give me some lore. We're looking for Durlin. Do you have an appointment? Hmm. Uh, no. Has anyone ever had an appointment here? You look fun. <laughs> here to collect on something, pal. Think uh, parading a severed head around on your hip is gonna scare me into somehow approving Esther's accretion proposal, eh? Right? Uh. <laughs> we are looking for a prisoner of Odin's. He's being kept in a mine somewhere. Some friends of ours said that you could help. Where did you get? You chop her head off with that too, eh? Oh. She was my wife, wife. Do 
Lena and I. You just have a pet octopus? After a little cool here failed. Failed. Yeah, come on, come on. Failed. Faye is dead. Best of them all. Hmm. One's left alive have to pay the price. I'm afraid <clears throat> I can't help you with your little prisoner situation. But he could have answers on how to stop Odin. And free Svartalfheim from the Aesir. Now, I'm not in the business of crossing the old father anymore. Wait, right. before you go. Deaner is really the name of that octopus. What is it? A fine. Hygiene code violation for improper transport of a rotting head. Uh, two demerits for speaking the old father's given name and, uh, uh, yeah. For fucking up my desk! A fine? Play it at your leisure, okay? Get out of my office. Hey there. So what about get out of my office? my office? Don't you understand? You, understand? you said her name was Diener? <laughs> oh, uh, sure. Thank, Thank you. you. I think. Exit Durlin's office to the port. Okay, so he clearly knew Faye. He recognizes Dead the axe. better not be leaking his decay all over my floor. I beg your pardon? So, is this just a dwarf thing to be super into hygiene? Hey, this isn't a fine. The dwarf has given us a map. Sort of. Uh, you smell him? But it seems to lead to a mine beyond that mountain. Oh, he did help ah, us. Derlin helped us anyway. Not everyone uses axes and arrows to fight. Alright, this might have to be my stopping point. The game is really fudging up for some reason. But that was that was interesting. Um I am very intrigued by that exchange we just had with Durlin. He know he clearly knows Faye, and he was clearly aggrieved to hear of her death. So there's backstory here. And I wanna know more about it. And we're getting close to tear. Hopefully, maybe. I don't know. We gotta go through a mine, and I'm sure there's gonna be a lot of shit we have to do in that mine. Um, hopefully by then I figure out why the fuck um it's it, the the recording got so persnickety but we'll figure it out i guess um but thank you everyone for watching um if you are interested the episodes for uh this god of war ragnarok playthrough will be uh every tuesday and friday i'm aiming to have them uploaded by about 4 p.m pacific um so stay tuned and uh, make sure you like and subscribe if you are enjoying the content. You can also uh, check me out on Twitch. The live streams uh, for January are on Saturdays and Sundays uh, at 8 p.m. Pacific. Um, starting back in February, I'll be um, back to streaming at my normal schedule, which is uh, Wednesday, Thursday, Saturday, Sunday at 8 p.m. So um, hope to see you then. Um, and uh, I will catch you on the next video. Bye-bye! Uh,